It is a five-speed electric car. <laughs> we gave some soul to that thing. And I must tell you, it's cool. It makes sound now. So you can literally go <laughs> What inspired that project? The challenge. Yeah. We start back in Brazil helping on electric conversions because there is a lot of a government rules. I have this badass forklift, but it has a four cylinder. Is that a way I don't have to buy a new one? And then people start doing conversions. Oh, we can build a controller for you and then we can recommend the motor and you can put it on that. And that's how we started actually. Okay. Small cars and stuff. And we started doing that. And then we need something cool. What is cool in the United States that everyone likes it? To some extent, at least. Yeah. Fox body, man. I'm a Chevy guy. I still like that thing. Mm -hmm. Took the 5 out, put it back the transmission. I think it's the T5. And then we made a plate, put the motor there. We have a battery pack on the nose, another one on the trunk. So we kind of balance it out. She actually lost weight, <laughs> but the range is great. It's about 150 to 180 miles. And it's fun. That's not a car to be cheap. That is not a car to be a daily commuter. That is not a drag racing car. All of our units, 450, 550, 600, and Vision FT, they have built-in EV controllers. If you connect to an inverter that is compatible with us, you can go there, you can do a hybrid. 